oven preheating at 375 degrees Fahrenheit and I have my cast iron skillet sprayed just like this because I'm about to bake some asparagus and bacon in the oven all right y'all so as you can see I have some asparagus I've already chopped the ends off and some bacon slices and all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take three thin ones and wrap them up and roll them over the bacon like this okay so we start at the end see right there I have to chop the ends off and all we're doing up for you so there you have it there's my bacon and my asparagus wrapped I already have half of a white onion chopped up y'all so while we're waiting on the oven to preheat to cook our asparagus we got two pieces of bacon these are nitrate free and they have not been cured with sugar or sucralose so we're going to fry these two pieces up and we're going to use that grease so we can add a tablespoon of butter and cook up our shrimp. Let me show you how I do that. Okay, y'all. So I got my shrimp cleaned up and peeled and washed. So now we are just waiting for our grease and butter to get ready. So the bacon is fried. This is the grease. I set it aside because it's really, really hot. I want to cool it down a little bit. Now right there, I got the two pieces of bacon. I put those aside because I'm gonna cut these up in pieces. And here's my butter that I'm gonna to add to the grease as soon as it cools off. Okay, so I have the steak and the onions. This is leftover steak, and y'all know I love to turn leftovers into a whole different meal. So leftover steak, half a white onion chopped up in pieces. And all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add some butter to the skillet and add some Worcestershire sauce to that. I have my asparagus right here, all rolled up, ready to go to the oven, and I am going to bake these for about 15 minutes. I'm actually melting the butter right here, as you can see, and it's off the burner, y'all, so just really, really off the burner, off the heat, just melting the butter. I put them on like this, and now I'm just going to sprinkle some pink Himalayan salt on them, just like that. Not a lot, y'all. Put them in the heat. Okay, and then I just sprinkle some of this seafood and chicken seasoning on it. Just a little bit, not a lot, y'all. And it's cooking. Okay, so my shrimp is cooked. The leftover grease, I am going to saute these onions. Okay, so while my onions are sauteed and browning, I have my meat right here. Now the shrimp and the two pieces of bacon, I already cut those up. Now I'm just going to mix these up with the onions, like that. And this is what it's looking like, y'all. This is less than a quarter cup of um, shredded mild cheddar cheese. That's heating up pretty. Here you have it, y'all. Sauteed shrimp with bacon and onions, steak, avocado, and bacon wrapped asparagus. This is dinner. Look at that. Yummy. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Wish I could have some.